this week? Well, last week. <laughs> last week I received my Pinebook Pro. Yes, you did. ANSI edition. Yes. What is ANSI? It's like, when you kind of get ooh, agitated ooh, and. <laughs> No, it's a keyboard. <laughs> it's like the US style keyboard. Yes, that's exactly right. So ANSI essentially means it's verba it's like it's a synonym synonym <laughs> synonym synonym a synonym for US keyboard layout. So okay. when you think about a US keyboard layout, you've got the slash in the right spot and you've got everything where you expect it to be. If you're Canadian US, right. it's like the US 104 keyboard. If you think about an ISO keyboard, that's kind of UK, yep. um, like overseas for us. And so their layout is completely different. So right. we found the ISO layout to be really problematic here in Canada. Right. Yeah. Keys aren't where you want them to be. You got to push control function. Tab, alt, backspace, backspace, exclamation point in order to do an apostrophe. Like, it's just ridiculous. It doesn't make any sense. No. And so Pine64 heard the cry of the Western world and said, you know what? We're going to bring out the U.S. keyboard layout on our next iteration of the Pinebook. The Pinebook Pro is going to be available in both ISO and ANSI keyboard layouts. And this makes me very, very happy. So let's yes. get a look at uh, the unboxing here. So you can see that my box, in fact, says ANSI. That is, again, the U.S. keyboard layout. You guys ready for this? Let's get into the box. Let's take a look. Our first look at the Pinebook Pro ANSI edition. Here we go. Uh, it's, box. Uh, it's another box. <laughs> Wow, look is at that. Is this one of those it's, things where like, you get a box yes. inside a box inside box a box? inside a box inside a box, yes. Isn't that like called nesting, doll. do nesting dolls? Yeah. Yes, yeah. we've got... Okay, you ready for the next box? Here we go. Here we go. Fingers ready. crossed Everybody's for, ready for the next something box. not a box. Here we, oh, that would be really nice if it was not a box. Maybe we could actually get a I Pine Book Pro. Plastic. Here we go! Oh, we've got some yeah. film and paper. Yes, we've got some packing foam. We've got a... Oh, look at that. A love letter from Pine64. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. Thing. My wife will be jealous. Uh, telling us all about it. Let's actually get a look at the Pine Book Pro. This has got to be it. That doesn't look like a box to me. I feel like we need some epic music or something oh, going yes. on. There we go. That's better. Uh, oh, not, nothing oh, else nothing in there. there. Okay. No other boxes. The box is empty now. <laughs> yep. All right. I've got my power supply that came with it. And let's take a look here. This is... Uh, now, I ordered the U.S. Oh, okay. Power supply. So this just kind of oh, so it's a, it's yeah, a just kind of flips on, um, and it's a it is five volt, three amp, and as you can see, it's barrel and okay. not it's not USB C like the yeah. like the Raspberry Pi four. Okay. All right, here we go. Look at that! Oh. Beautiful. That's sleek. That is um, a magnesium alloy shell. Okay. Right so this is like a metal body and we've got the micro SD. We've got a headphone jack and USB 2.0 right there on the side. Okay. Flipping around to the other side, we've got the barrel input for the power. We've got USB three and USB type C, which can be oh, okay. video output. It can be uh, power, whatever you like. Look at how thin and how streamlined thin is, is that? Oh, is that like boy, you're asking quarter, me to measure this? You can see quarter of an inch, half an inch. It's top. just so thin and so it's like a MacBook Air. But this, okay, I want to tell you, this is 200 bucks. Oh, That's amazing. I there have you are. Built a bigger cup of water on my. There's the keyboard right there. So this That's is the anti keyboard. Look at the um, the slash key. It's in the right spot. Two is also the at. You can see the keyboard layout is what you would expect yes. here in Canada, yes. the United States. And that is the Pinebook Pro. So looking at the specifications, it's a 2 gigahertz rock chip RK3399 SoC. That's the same as a Rock Pro 64, beautiful SoC. It's got a Mali T860 MP4 GPU. It's got four gigs of RAM, a 1080p IPS panel. Even though it's so sleek and so uh, so thin, it's got that nice monitor on there. It's got, uh, uh, it comes with a 64 gigabyte eMMC, which is upgradable if you wanna add a little bit extra storage to that system. 